If he's like that, then you're next. Who is like that? <laughs> hey guys, it's the loud guys. Today we are going to watch Chris Rock special Women Don't Like Nice Guys. So at this time we are going to turn to one chica and ask her like, do you also do not like l l nice guys? I, I I do think that it's not me who doesn't like nice guys. It's like every girl doesn't like nice guys. I do think that every girl fall in love with uh, bad guys only. Why is that? Because nice guys take care of you and do all those things and you still don't like nice guys. Why is that? I don't know. Maybe we got easily attracted to the bad ones. I don't know. <laughs> oh, so the thing is bad ones are attractive but the thing is in long term and those bad ones might hurt you but still women are women. They'll always choose the right thing. What they feel is right. And also the thing is like this is this video is like made by Chris Rock and we all know like Chris Rock by that famous incident that recently happened happened where he made fun of Will Smith's wife and Will Smith was like do not talk about my wife ever again so we will get to know more about him and I think so like he, Chris Rock might be talking about Will Smith only that women don't like uh, nice guys because Will Smith was a bad guy when he hit him so let's see how it is. Same I'm also so much excited to the video because of the title only and maybe it is going to be very relatable for me because I do think that the most of the for most of the girls they fell in love with the bad ones only and uh, and mostly sometimes what happens that the girl got serious in the relationship with the bad ones and the bad ones didn't give a damn about the girls uh, i don't know why it happens but it is the truth only so this video is going to be so relatable and yes i'm so much excited to watch this video so let's watch yes and also if you guys are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe to the channel and let's watch this video Wait. Don't know, don't know, don't know. A lot of women here, that's cool. I like women. Mother's a woman, that helps. You know what's fuck? But like whenever my female friends start talking about, you know, my boyfriend's crazy. I didn't know he was crazy. I didn't know he was out of his mind. He just slipped. <laughs> women, if you want to know if your man is crazy or not, just check out his relationship with his mother. Yeah. That's all you got to do, check out his relationship with his mother. Because he's like, hey, mom, fuck you. Kiss my ass. I don't give a fuck. I'll put this foot up your ass. If he's like that, then you're next. Who is like that? <laughs> and you are next. Woo! I think I think so. Late to school, late to work. <laughs> so, women, 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 and women, women, women. Women, women. <laughs> Only you get the most shit you learn about. One thing you learn about women, man. Women don't like nice guys. Say they do, don't. <laughs> they got to have an asshole first. <laughs> Every woman goes through an asshole phase. They gotta go with Ike, then Mike. <laughs> That's right. You know what's bad? If you're a nice guy like me, you always get women after they've been out with an asshole. <laughs> so now you gotta be their boyfriend and their psychiatrist <laughs> to help them get over this psycho. That's right. For every 20 minutes of pussy, three hours of therapy. <laughs> oh, oh, ooh. You know why? It starts in childhood. It starts in childhood. Little girls like little bad boys. Like little boy gives little girl Valentine's Day card. She don't want him. Hmm. She don't want nothing to do with him. Yeah. She wants a little boy to just punch her in the back and run down the hall. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, I love him. He's so cute. <laughs> then you grow up and you marry that same little boy. And then he and punches you. You know you're an Oprah going, I don't know what I did to deserve this. <laughs> it just ain't right. <laughs> No, you picked that man. You chose that man. Yeah. You know, you could have had nice boy Roy, but you picked Ass Whoop McGee. Yes. <laughs> oh, bro, I love Ass Whoop. He's a good man. Oh, In between oh, Ass Whoop, he reads poetry. The violets are blue, roses are red. Time to kick a bitch in the head. <laughs> 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 Ass Whoop McGee original. Uh, women. You know the cool thing about women that I like, like about women? A woman can fall in love with an ugly man and admit it. Yeah. yeah. Show him off to all her friends and the family. Be the ugliest guy in the world. And they'll be so proud of that ugly man. They'll hold his hand, drag him around the place, introduce him to people like, this is Kevin. I want you to meet Kevin. I know he's not that attractive, but he's good to me. <laughs> Men aren't like that. A man will never admit to being in love with an ugly woman. Yeah, yeah. We'll hide yeah, that shit yeah, the yeah, they will never. Never. nobody. Yeah, we gonna be getting married. Hey man, I heard you get married. Who told you that? 
Don't spread no rumors, all right? Yo, some of you women don't know if you're ugly or not. They give yourself a test. <laughs> Just a little test, don't be scared. Yo, have you been over a guy's house more than four times, been fucked every time, and haven't met anybody in the house? <laughs> he don't think you look that good. Oh. Like, every time you go over, all you see is one room. <laughs> but I gotta pee. Hold it in. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's me. I know that's me. Men, we got one movie just fuck, but won't take y'all. <laughs> oh, that's me. That's right. We got one movie just fuck, but won't take y'all. <laughs> but women, y'all just as mean. Y'all got men to let take you out, but you won't fuck. <laughs> this guy's on dates right now. Ain't getting shit. Yeah. So yeah, I'ma loosen her up with a little comedy. She's like, ain't nothing that funny. <laughs> That's right, you can't ha ha your way into this. See, that's the problem, man. We always think we could buy sex. Like, but take it here, she give me some. Mm. But buy this, she give me some. Mm. Nothing gets you nothing. Shit, a woman knows she's gonna fuck you within the first five minutes of meeting you. Women know on the handshake, they shaking hands like, I'm gonna fuck him. <laughs> I hope he don't say nothing stupid. <laughs> That's right. Can't say nothing stupid because women are all about the mood. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. She's in the mood. Just shut up. Let it happen. Because <laughs> if you say the wrong thing, them panties are coming up fast. I you what are the most Excuse me, what you say? Mysterious creature <laughs> in the world. Tell it. Yeah. Oh. <coughs> easy to get in one. Easy to get in a relationship. Hard to maintain. Mm -hmm. You know? It's like in marriage. Marriage to me is not even a natural state to be married for life. Anything for life just promotes laziness, okay? Yeah. Marriage shouldn't be for life. Marriage should be like a driver's license. Five years and renew. <laughs> yes. Wow. Shit. I <laughs> love that fourth year. Ooh, it'd be good, man. <laughs> it's rough, man. It's hard, man. It's hard to maintain a relationship, man. Because at some point, no matter who it is, at some point you have heard everything this person has to say. Yeah, you yeah. heard it all. Yes. You know what they get ready to say before they even say it. You remember that time? Yeah, I remember. <laughs> they ever tell you, yeah, you told me. <laughs> You've heard it all. Yes. And then what happens? You stop talking. Have a breakdown of communication. Yet you got to talk. Because women love to talk. Mm. Women love to talk. If they had talking in the Olympics, a man wouldn't stand a chance. <laughs> Women love to talk. And fellas, women don't want us to talk to them. They just want us to set them up. Yeah. That's all women want you to do. If you're in a relationship with a woman, it's like being in a comedy team and you're the straight man. You <laughs> set her up, feed her lines. All the women want you to do is go, how was your day? Yeah. That's what they want. How was your day? Because how was your day is a half hour conversation to a woman. Yes. It's a whole half hour. And you as the man, the only thing you got to do is go, uh-huh. Get out of here. Really? Get out of here. I told you that bitch is crazy. <laughs> oh my God. But eventually, hey, women, you talk too much. You do. You got to learn how to turn it down a little bit. You ever notice no man comes straight home? No man comes straight home. Every man in here has to go somewhere as soon as he gets off work. He got to go drink something. Snort something, shoot something in his veins, something to get him ready for the talking that he's about to hear. Something oh to deaden his senses. <laughs> and women, it's not that you talk too much. You talk too much as soon as we get in the house. As <laughs> soon as we get in the door. You ain't gonna believe it. Guess what happened? To you ain't gonna believe that. You ain't gonna believe what happened today, and guess what happened to Hey! Let me get in the fucking house! <laughs> let me get my other foot in there! Shit! Come on! Let me read the paper! Let me have something to eat! Let me take a shit there! <laughs> Y'all gotta go! Y'all be cool! Woo! My God. Oh my god, it was so hilarious and it was also too relatable. I related a lot from this video and I do think that one thing which he said right is that the way the boy behaved with his uh, mother the and the way he's only going to be behave with you and because if he and if you don't respect his mother then how can he you know respect you so i do think that this is the only thing which is said good uh, and uh,
and i don't think it's uh, basically the truth and seriously i enjoyed it a lot and uh, he was he was saying the truth only i do think that uh, i am obviously a woman and i do think that women are the most mysterious creature of the world uh, and we love talk we love talk you know if you know if you don't know somebody you know if you know don't know any girl i am a woman i don't know this girl then we will you know if we will start talking then we will take 2 to 6 hours in talking only so it's our behavior it's our nature we cannot do anything with it so <laughs> the, basically in the, uh, in this video he you know he roasted us so much and literally i didn't felt it ba- i didn't feel anything bad i seriously enjoyed it yes and i the thing is the thing i say to my friends is my female friends is that you can even talk to a light pole so that's how much they talk and he was very very right about everything because he was like completely he had a full you can say burst out about women and the first part where he was like talking about like choosing nice guys he was like women never choose nice guys they are always like okay this guy is very bad i'll choose him and then they'll cry afterwards oh yeah. this how come this guy changed because he was the same previously but you couldn't even see that and that was very fun to watch also all the other parts where the, he was like women don't let like the best part was women are very like proud of their man they're like even if the man is ugly they will show off him yeah. like okay this is kevin this is kevin but men don't do that so that is one thing that men don't do is like if if the woman is ugly they'll not show off because they'll know okay the other guys will tell her oh you could have chosen better this and that and then they won't be able to defend and so this was a very very fun skit like i have only seen chris rock like <coughs> getting a punch from will smith but this was a very new and very fun video how did you guys find this video do let us know in the comment section below so do like share and subscribe bye, bye.